I think it was great. Uh, obviously, Indoor is known as you know high scoring, high scoring venue, and and to finish up the game the way we did, I think it's very satisfying. I thought you know our bowlers set it up the game brilliantly, and we filled it very well as well. Few runouts here and there made made a huge difference. And when you were chasing 90, I mean <laughs> you 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 got to go out there, and we had a chance of you know uh, increasing our run rate as well. So that that also we kept in mind. And yeah, overall, I mean, very very satisfying. <laughs> I think he's, he's bowling brilliantly. I thought you know against. Uh, Against England, against England and Australia, against England, when I played uh, test matches there also in last year, he bowled brilliantly in those 17 home test matches where he played. But I think, I think now, I think he's bowling at his best. I think, you know, I mean, that he got the reward also that he is now being part of the, all the formats in, in, in the Indian team as well. But I thought he's bowling really well, he's thinking right, and more than that, whatever he's thinking, whatever he's trying to do, he's executing well as well. You know, I think, I think whatever plans he's made, I mean, I've been part of the bowlers meeting and, and you know, I mean, whatever we've decided, whatever we want, what we've planned and he's been, he's been executing, that's something is very special. So obviously we, we, know, we know that, I mean, the way Kings Eleven played uh, throughout the season, they've, they've relied heavily on, on either Gale or, or, or Kale Rahul. And yeah, I mean, to get them out both in first six overs, we, we knew that, you know, I mean, I mean, we can run through this middle order and, and we had that belief that's something which uh, we were uh, talking during, uh, after every weekend that if we can get one, we can get them out under 120, 130. And as as the wickets kept falling, our, our runs also, you know, we spoke about from 130 to we came to under 100 as well. I don't know about 2016, 17 because I was not with RCB. But yeah, <laughs> yeah I mean, see, obviously, this this I, uh, the IPL is all about momentum. You know, I mean, every time if you see when you get two, three, four wins in a, in a row, you know, that's where the teams teams qualify. And and I'm, yeah, but there are, we were settled. There is no doubt. I thought there were a couple of games where we thought you know we could have finished, but we could not. And and that happens in T20 format. You know, I mean, the game goes here and uh, one ball here and there, and it changes the whole complexion. But I thought, you know, the way we we are playing, the way I think even after almost out of the tournament, like two games before, but we we still uh, came out and and fought really hard. We we showed a lot of positive energy and a lot of intent to you know win games. See, honestly, I believe that uh, you know while I'm batting, uh, I I have that great great belief on myself that I could hit boundaries, I could find the gap. Uh, playing just cricketing shots, I don't have to go out there and you know try and slog my way into the uh, first six overs. That I, I think you know after having having played for so many years, knowing my game and and sticking to it, and even under pressure, you know every time whenever there is pressure, I try and stick to more than a, a cricketing shot rather than a slog slog. And then every time I've tried to slog, I've got out. Uh, so uh, you know, I try I try and play uh, according to my game, and I, I I strongly believe that I could hit boundaries by just normal play normal cricketing shots